Man, I'm about tired of motherfucking talking about her. But Jada Pinkett Smith affirmed that she wasn't unfaithful to Will Smith. I just need people to know. So I guess this was nothing. But while sitting down talking to Fat Joe, Jada Pinkett Smith says that her and Will's kids are not worried after recent headlines. They live with us. She even got a pair of Terror Squad Air Force Ones. The TS stands for Tupac Shakur. Speaking of Tupac, Jada Smith calls Tupac her soulmate. I said he was my soulmate? That's what they saying you said. Where? That's all over. Where? Where is it? You gotta read the book. You gotta, you read, gotta the book. read the book. Well, according to her, she didn't say that. And Jada Pinkett Smith said that Tupac Shakur silently battled alopecia, just like her ass. Man, I'm starting to think that Pac put a hit out on himself just to get away from this damn woman, bro. And where's Will Smith, man? Motherfucker, he been real quiet about this lately. And this is how Will has responded to it all. Notifications off. Living his best life. We got a little bit of news to talk about, y'all. Let's get into it, man. But all, oh, man, in other news, we got a little bit to talk about, man. I'm going to try my best not to hold y'all up. But rest in peace to TV actress Suzanne Summers, man. She passed away from cancer at the age 76. I remember growing up watching her on a lot of TV shows, man. So what a beautiful Mrs. Suzanne Summers. May she rest in peace. So it looks like El Chapo sent a lower drug cartel bars fentanyl production under the penalty of death. Good, that shit killing folk. So it looks like a Florida teen confesses to stabbing his mother to death in her sleep. Our girl Monica feels like she's R&B's most forgotten star. I read the comment section, man. A lot of people had mixed reactions. A lot of folks said she may feel that way because she has a nasty attitude and she spends more time nowadays trying to be a goon than an artist. What y'all think? Our guy Drake officially ties Michael Jackson as the male soloist with the most number one hits. And he's still active, so you know that shit can change at any time. The NHL, yep, they banned Pride Tape. After getting into a fight in Dominican Republic, yeah man, DR police snatched 6 9 ass up and just whisked him through the goddamn crowd to jail. That shit look rough as a motherfucker, man. Bow, bow, just let bow, bow. Well, she won't be going back to Pound Town no time soon, cause congratulations to our girl's Texas Red. She seemingly announces that she's pregnant. She was trying her best to hide it, but hey, I guess she can't do it no more. Then she goes on to explain why she stopped hiding her pregnancy from us. She said, I was pregnant as fuck on here. Trona sucked my belly in. I got tired of faking. She said, I couldn't even breathe. She broke all the hearts of niggas who's on house arrest. That wear white tees, long white tees, all caps that come from the gas station and smoke Newport 100s, man. Congratulations! <laughs> yes, sir. Happy birthday and belated birthday to singer, the beautiful Keisha Cole, our dog, singer, genuine, uh, part of the Jackson 5, singer, our guy Tito Jackson, funny girl, actress slash comedian, Kim Wayans, actress slash comedian, also Terry Vaughn, and tennis star, Naomi Osaka. Yes, sir. This same day yesterday in history, October 15, 1966, the iconic Black Panther Party was started, man. This same day today, October 16, 1995, a million black men and women marched in D.C. This same day here, October 16, 1968, Mr. Tommy Smith and Mr. John Carlos raised their black fists in pride at the Olympics. And on this same day here, October 16, 2021, our dog Young Thug, he releases his album, Punk. Yes, sir. Drake's son, Adonis, he got them bars for y'all. Like like I guess we know who wrote for Drake now. Good folk down there at Ferrari say, hey man, if you got some crypto, come get a car. We accept it. A martial artist punches a seven foot kangaroo that was drowning his dog. I seen the video, I thought the kangaroo was catching a ride. And Blueface Mama out here setting out thirst traps. You know our son wasn't going for that. Blueface responded by saying, old lady booty cheeks, laughing face, puke face, ew, lol. Blueface mother responded by saying, nah, I said it was an accident, but it looked better than the one you spent your life savings on. Blueface went on to say, why are you comparing your booty cheeks to the lady I sleep with every night? That's a little creepy, lol, what is the correlation? She wrote back, keep trying me and I'll post the before pictures I gave you a head start, mf -er, keep playing. I ain't gonna lie though, looking at uh, his baby mama's booty cheeks and looking at my dukes, shit, that ain't even a hard one. I'ma eat your ass. <laughs> 
Yes, sir, tonight's weather. Shouts out to Boston, Massachusetts, man. Y'all 52 degrees, y'all mostly cloudy. And shouts out to Orlando, the Pine Hills area. Y'all 67 degrees, but y'all mostly clippy, dog. And happy belated birthday to these two beautiful sisters, my girl Libra Queen and my girl, I see you out there, Mrs. LaWanda Davenport. Yes, sir. I hope y'all enjoyed yourselves. And be on the lookout for Mr. Potter 400 Lakes on all platforms, November 5th, yeah. But say, family, it's Monday. I know, womp womp. But if you're picking up what I'm putting down, make sure to also follow me on Instagram and YouTube at News A. Please help me run the numbers up. I see the love and support. I really appreciate it. And follow me on Thread. And if you want me to shout you out the news report, uh, birthday, what college you go to, anything, drop them shits in the comments. You know I'm going to take care of you. Until next time, family, I'm going to holler at y'all. Y'all be careful out there.